A vacation to Florida ends in tragedy for an Illinois family. Their small plane crashed in western Kentucky. The only survivor, a seven-year-old girl. She walked a mile through thick woods and in the rain to get help. Omar Villafranca reports. After surviving the crash of her family's small plane, seven-year-old sailor Gutzler walked nearly a mile through dense Kentucky woods to the door of Larry Wilkins. A little girl about seven, eight years old. I was standing there, she had blood on her face. She said, Mom and Dad are dead. We had a plane crash, and the plane's upside down. It was cold, dark, and rainy. Wilkins says the little girl was crying, wearing no shoes and only light summer clothes. She was barefooted, by the way. She had one sock on her feet, and she walked all that distance barefooted. She a brave little girl, extremely. She done a hell of a job, as far as I'm concerned. Sailor's family was flying home from vacation in Key West, Florida, to Mount Vernon, Illinois, in a twin-engine Piper, similar to this one. This family photo was snapped aboard the plane last week. The father and pilot, 48-year-old Marty Gutzler, reported engine trouble right before the plane crashed, just four miles from a small airport in Lyon County, Kentucky. The crash killed Gutzler, his wife Kimberly, Sailor's 9-year-old sister Piper, and 14-year-old cousin Sierra Wilder. Sailor, the lone survivor, suffered a broken wrist and some cuts and scratches. I just pray for her. She's going to need a lot of help, a lot of help. The cause of the crash is under investigation. Omar Villafranca, CBS News. Sailor was treated and released from the hospital. Her family has requested privacy.